I mean, has it caught you out a bit or? Not too much. Like, is it a bit more invisible now? Like the... Wow. Jesus Christ. Tom, you're an animal, bro. Yes, Tom. You all right? How's it going, mate? The man himself. Absolutely, yeah. So, guys, I've come down to film a few cars. I don't know which order I've put them in. It may have been this one first, the other one second. So, G8 M3, I'm really excited to get yeah, out of here today. I have been in the passenger seat. Yeah. I'm hoping, fingers crossed, you're going to yeah. let me get in the driver's Absolutely, seat. Absolutely, mate. Yeah, you can have a proper go in this today. Yeah. So, um, this is G80, latest and greatest from BMW. I think it looks awesome, to be fair. A lot of criticism about the grill, but I'm really happy with it at the moment. So, we've got um, stage one software on there and uh, our full stainless steel exhaust massive increase in power making 622 horsepower now and numbers wise some very very fast times very very That's good it, yeah. on road performance yeah standard car um, it was doing sort of 7.98 seconds flat 100 to 200 we've got it down to a six flat this morning just on 99 just a stage one map so stage one map, stage one map. six seconds flat yeah, yeah, yeah. this car is going to be i'm confident we can see fours out on stock turbos i really am Whoa. so let's um let's see how it goes with the so development what's the deal then because the ecu there's been trouble yeah it's just all locked now, so the, you have to send the ECU off way to be locked, unlocked to start with. There's only one man in the world that can do it. And then from there, you can tune it. So I've tuned this one again with Mike Ball, who's been doing a lot of my tuning recently. Um, we're working really closely together. He's done a great job on it so far. But it drives so nice as well. As you've, you've driven lots of my cars that I've built, yeah. it's not all about power. I've said this so many times. It's about how it puts it down. A yeah. lot more to it. The chassis on this is a lot better than the F80. It was 100%. Okay. It puts the power down a lot nicer. Yeah, so. no, my first opinion on this car, I probably did a lot of hating mm. at the beginning, but I, mate, I was your car, that is unbelievable. This is making me want one now. This is really making me want one. So this is a shop car as well. This Absolutely. is yours, this ain't a customer yeah, car. Yeah, no, this is our own car. So it's, um, yeah, it's our own customer car. We actually, got, we actually got two of these. So we've got one at home, which is just a standard one, which I keep. And then we've got this one, is our one we're going to be turning it up. Mate, lend me some money. <laughs> and you've had an exhaust one. Yeah, so well. it's our exhaust. Yeah, yeah, I'll give it a little rev, you know. So. so, yeah, definitely a complaint, probably, with these cars already is the exhaust. <laughs> Sounds a lot better, doesn't it? Yeah. Nice. It's got nothing too crazy. It's Deep just, though, isn't it? Yeah, it's not like amplified. We're not, yeah. we're not trying to do anything crazy with it, just a nice little amplifying noise. We give this um, exhaust with the option, it's just straight cut steel, we can put some tips on it as well. Mm. I'm quite liking this motorsport look at the yeah, moment. Yeah, I do honest. as well, I like it's, it a lot. It's raw and uh, yeah. it works nice. So yeah. just for people that aren't aware, it's a three litre twin turbo. Three litre twin turbo, so it's called the S58 engine. A lot of people are familiar with the B58. I got a 240 with the B58. It's a similar block and head, but they've, they've tweaked it a lot more now. A lot of things have been done to it. It's, it's not much B58 left, so. Lots of potential. Again, we don't know what the limiting factors are. Touch wood, it's a nice strong engine, but yeah. this is why we have a development. This is, I, know, I, don't, I don't ever put things on customers' cars that I don't test myself. That's just how I work, and then that way you can offer the customer the best and safest options. There's always a risk with tuners, we know, but if you can use the best people and the best software and everything, you limit that risk as much as you can, yeah, and we exactly. get knowledge. And would you say it handles better than the pre? Uh, it feels heavier. It feels somewhere between an F80 and may maybe an M5, if I'm mm. honest. It feels planted, comes with a lot wider tyres on from factory. Brakes are a lot, lot better, I will say that much. We are doing a brake kit for it, but I think standard these brakes are very very good it's actually f90 brakes all around on it uh, i've gone for the factory m performance brake kit got the red calipers and the disc the bigger disc yeah um, you can get the ceramics as well if you wish but i'm not really a massive fan of ceramics i think for the road i'm more than happy with the uh, the steel ones a little quick look at the interior oh, yeah, yeah. apologies it's a little bit dirty uh, but got all the carbon specced inside i didn't go for the carbon seats which you can just purely for practicality, really. It's um, yeah, XPZ of yeah, yeah, same no same gearbox as uh, the X4M, and not too yeah. different to the F90 gearbox. So plenty of power. It'll take it well. Um, so yeah, it's exciting. Yeah.
that sounds nice, doesn't it? Straight away. It's a nice grunt, isn't it? So what's your plan moving forward? You like it's obviously Yeah, just gonna... just do it step for step for customers. So like I said, we start off with stage one like with this one, just building up building up the maps really. Stage one, stage two. Make sure it feels safe. Make sure it feels safe, find the limits of things. I mean, I don't know what they're gonna do with hybrids on it. So we're so far ahead of where we were with G uh, with F eighties, it's like where's it gonna end? For me, this is 620 brake from just a stage one. It's running six seconds flat. That's ridiculous. You know, if you went back a few years before Draggy was even a thing, you jump in this car, you'd be like, mate, that's a ridiculous so, car. So this you know, on a stage one is basically as quick as a, a stock R8. Yeah, exactly. Roughly. Like, yeah, I yeah, think yeah. An R8 very, very five, good. Eight, yeah, very good comparison, five, seven, actually. Five, yeah. Eight. You'd give an R8 a headache, so. Um, mate, you give it a proper headache. Yeah, and you'd be gutted, wouldn't you, to see this in your mirror? If you had an R8. <laughs> <laughs> this is our dev shop car development car. And then we've got this the second one just keep standard as it is. So are you gonna get an X drive one? Um I'll see. I mean I'm a bit annoyed really because when I ordered this car, they were told me that the X Drive one was miles off coming out of me, so I thought I've got to get going on development on the G80, I don't want to be waiting for an X Drive one. Mm. Then when this did land, all of a sudden the X Drive ones came. Yeah. I will have an experiment with an X Drive one. What's uh, the point in even doing a rear wheel version and an all wheel drive version? I don't know, I guess it's just I mean, the M5 you could put it into rear wheel yeah. if you wanted to. So why don't they do the same? I don't know. Well, it's already shown on car wow in a, in a, in a rolling yeah. situation. The rear wheeler starts to reel in the uh, four wheel, doesn't it? <laughs> Sounds sick, doesn't it? Yeah, it's cool. Bloody hell. Looks very controllable. Yeah. That steering rack's quick, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, that is rapid, isn't it? Stage one, it's not bad, is it? No, Picks that's a speed. kick, boy. Yeah. Eight gears, obviously, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, it's going to be similar to, like, the M140, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it bangs through the gears. Bang, yeah, yeah, yeah. bang through Talk the gears. Talk all over the place. It's literally F90 style, mm. nice and modern. Mm. Guys, can you believe it? I'm actually driving a G80 M3 right now. Like, it's been how First long drive. since this car's been released? It's been a while, isn't it? Six, maybe six months or so. It doesn't like feel big though, does it? It feels now. nice and yeah. compact, doesn't it? I don't want to make it too heavy, um, hard on the suspension. Bro, this feels sick, man, straight away. Hey, that front, bro, the way it's darting across. Different level, smooth, isn't it? Whoa, like and that's, relentless. Like, yeah, I thought, yeah. like, because I felt second and it must have been limiting the traction. It was, yeah. Well, I think the traction yeah, yeah. is still on, so yeah, <laughs> that's sick. Yeah, it's more F90, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I think that. It sounds sick as well, though, doesn't it? It does. So are you daily driving this? Yeah, this is my daily. And how, how do you feel about it? Love you loving it? it? Love loving it, it, yeah. I'm over the moon with it. And like I said, I'm just so excited to see what the future brings with it. It'd be lovely to see a four out of one with stock turbos. I don't, don't mm, see why it's mm. not going to be possible. Yeah. Um, we're already at, you know, hybrids on an F80 with, with just pump fuel. That's the performance we're at now. Crazy. You know, you need to be running meth on ones. I mean, initially when we retuned your one, it came to us, what, five and a half? Yeah. 100 to 200, well, that puts in perspective. Yeah. That was a full build, mate. Yeah, yeah so guys, uh, Tom's gonna take us around a few bends in a sec. Mm. Hard to kind of relay information when we're just driving on the straight, but I feel like a boss driving this straight away, man. I'd love to be daily driving it. Super comfortable. Um, nice light wheel. I mean, it's it, not. Let's not say light. It, it responds really quick. Yeah. So like the wheel's weighty. Yeah. But um, what it is, the body good is feeling. very responsive. Yeah. The gearbox is working really good. There's no like massive bump. Um, no, it's not. Obviously ZF box. It's smoothened out a bit. Though, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right at the top, you like, you know, that's where it usually fades off. Yeah, but. Yeah. Man, it falls 
done it. It does, full real life. Yeah, these are the roads this car's yeah. for, man. This is the famous bit now. What's <laughs> <laughs> the mud here? Man, the front end, boy. You can feel how much more it's hugging the road, isn't it? This is the, this is the one we got a bit loose <laughs> on last time. <laughs> It's almost just a little playful, isn't it, on the rear? Yeah, it's moving about a bit, isn't it? Private road, as we all remember. <laughs> Mate, it just glides, isn't it? It's just, no, it's effortless. Yeah, it's just nothing to the car, man. You ain't even got to do much steering. No. It just turns into corners. There's a lot going on in here. I don't know where to look, people. Please don't go kill us, Tom. No, I'm not doing no madness. <laughs> not like last time. Yeah. It's a bit younger then. <laughs> <laughs> It just moves, doesn't it? I mean, has it caught you out a bit, or? Not too much. Like, is it a bit more invisible now? Like, the... Wow. Jesus Christ, Tom, you're an animal, bro. Hell. It's not, it's not been too bad now, it's not really bad. Bro, you can drive, man. Look at that, using up the road. <laughs> Yours. You know what, I love being in a car so I can drive, man. Like, I can assure you that this car would never get driven like this by one person in the country. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, I've yeah. been like dabbling yeah. with a bit of track stuff, guys. So, watching him, it's like, whoa, the way he uses up the road. And yeah, it's, uh, it, it, makes, it makes it nice to drive. Bro, it? look how cable it is out of the it box, is. man. <laughs> I mean, do you think you could do like what we just did there in an M4? Like regen? No, no, not, not quite, standard. No way. You no. Couldn't. Not just speed, but like, I mean, straight You can see the way it's controlled, though. It's, yeah. It doesn't it's feel like you're about to crash. Sort of, you know, yeah. it's taking the road, it's yeah. gliding over the road. Yeah. It's, it's really taking it within its own mm. stride. It's not easy. It's just doing yeah. it for fun, isn't it? Absolutely. And you remember, this is stock, mate. And it's also got Pirelli's, which I've never been a fan of. And the four S's, you know, it's going to transform it. Yeah. But no, it's a properly sorted car, and thank you to BMW, that's all I will say. It's uh, They've given us a great, great base. And, um, I mean, yeah. the times these cars are doing around the Nürburgring, bone stock, a joke, yeah. really. What are they, in the 730? Yeah, yeah, now? yeah. And it's like baffling. It's exciting, so, yeah. Absolutely baffling. Yeah. Yeah. All right, Tom. Well, uh, thank you so much not for the problem, invite. Buddy. And uh, we've got some other cars that we filmed yeah. as well, so if you've not seen them, I may not have uploaded them yet, but. Uh, if you have, I'll link him to the uh, link him in the description, and also I'll link the vlog as well. We shot a little uh, video of his workshop, so um, Check yeah, Tom, where can people find you? Just so, so, yeah, right social media is uh, just Tom Ridley Performance. Instagram's kept pretty up to date. Um, I do all the Instagram, so it just depends how busy we are. But it, you know, we, we keep as much on there as we can. Give us a follow, give us a like, and um, see what follow us on what we're up to there. Cool, man. Well, I'll leave all your links in the description. Thank you, buddy. Respect, Tom. Cheers, mate. Thank you. And uh, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, please hit the thumbs up, subscribe, and leave to the channel, and I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye. Yo, what's a right or a left turn? Lamborghini made the heads turn. Enough fuel for the next journey. Man's wheel spinning, got the heads turning. Exhaust smoke like a fire burning. Just bought a bim, a month buying Germans. Halfway I want, didn't buy a permit. Wanna join the team, then buy a jersey. Yo, full tank full of gasoline. Yeah. We are.